Hello, my name is Tex Smith. That's Tex like the state of Texas, except with two X's. And today I'm going to show you uh, a really fast, easy way to uh, speed up Windows Vista and improve the battery life and reduce its temperature. Um, as you can see, I have a, um, I've connected with TeamViewer to my Windows Vista laptop. It's, it's an old one. It's fairly powerful, though. Um, but as you can see, it's like using 65% of its to 75% of its uh, processor, and it's doing nothing. Um, here, we can illustrate that a little better. Um, and uh, the temperature is a you know uh, 162 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, again, it's doing nothing. It's just sitting there idle. Um, and the reason I'm connecting uh, via TeamViewer is so that the um, screen recording software doesn't increase the processor usage. Um, but anyway, there's two ways to do this. Uh, one is you can use the command prompt, and I'll go at, over that command in just a minute. Uh, but the easiest way, I think, um, is to go into... Oh, here, let me just right-click on the taskbar, choose Task Manager, open up the Services tab, sort them by name, and then reverse sort with them and this one Windows Update that's the culprit right there if you can watch this well, we're gonna turn it off turn it off and you're gonna watch this processor usage just fall through the floor now I recommend that every now and then you turn it on and leave it on so it can check for updates but um, for the most part you don't need this uh, and it uses so much processor so anyway it's really easy right click on it stop service. It takes a couple seconds to stop, but watch this. Watch, watch. Well, here, we'll watch it here. Watch these lines. They're going to fall through the floor any minute. Uh, TeamViewer is using some of my resources, too, but you can still see the big drop. Usually, without TeamViewer going, um, it drops down to like 3%. Yeah, 3%. So, that, you know, that's a... Oh, yeah, here we go. It's it's still slowing. But anyway, um, and the... You know, it's more dramatic than even... Uh, um, but anyway, there you go. That's a quick little tutorial. Oh, oh the command prompt. Thank step. Now, this isn't going to work exactly correct because this service is already stopped. But for those of you who like to use the command prompt better. Um, it's net space stop space w u a u s e r v and then it says it's not started but usually it'll say the Windows Update service is stopping and then the next line it'll be a minute and then the next line will say the Windows Update service has been stopped and then you can just close it. And there you go. I hope you've enjoyed this uh, quick little, and this will help you uh, keep you from throwing away that Windows Vista laptop and um, or desktop or whatever it is you got, because um, it's going to run so much faster now and be so much more stable and cooler, run cooler and extend your battery life. So uh, I hope this helps you. You have a great day. Goodbye from Tech Smith. That's Tex with two X's, like the state of Texas. Anyway. Have a good day.